So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to use RoboCopy to exclude certain folders from being copied. So this is how you do it. As always, you want to go ahead and type the word RoboCopy, and then you'll want to put your source and your destination folder in quotation marks. So here, my folder is on the C drive and it's in a folder called test. So you want to do C test, that is my source. And then we are going to put this into a new folder called C test two. And if you were to go ahead and run this command, it would just copy the folders here, all of them, but we actually want to go ahead and exclude certain folders from being copied. Now, if you check here inside each of these folders, I have a test file. So from my other video, remember if you want to go ahead and copy subfolders and its contents, you'll want to use the slash E. And this is where it gets exciting. Now, if you want to exclude certain folders from being copied in RoboCopy, you'll have to use the flag XD. Um, I, I think it stands for exclude directory. And this is what we're gonna use. So again, you can use the quotation marks here. So say for instance, if we want to only copy the first two folders and exclude the rest, we would have to, uh, in RoboCopy, go ahead and, and tell it to exclude all three of those directories. Now, if we wanted to go ahead and only um, copy the first four, all you have to do is exclude the directory for the last one. But for the first example that I said, we are only going to copy test the folder test one and test two, and we are going to exclude these three folders here. So to do that, let's go ahead and again, open up the quotation mark. We're gonna go C, um, this is test, and the subfolder here is test three. And again, if you want to do multiple folders, you just have to repeat the command as well. So this is gonna be XD, forgot my quotation marks, C test, test four, and then XD, C, I keep forgetting my quotation marks here, C test, test five, and that is it. Now, if we go ahead and run this, uh, if we follow the logic, we are going to take the contents in C test, transfer them over to a new folder called C test two. We're going to use the slash E flag to copy all of the subfolders and its contents, but we are going to be excluding the following directories. We are going to be excluding the test three folder. We are going to be excluding the test four folder, and we are going to be excluding the test five folder. So let's go ahead and run that and we will see if it actually worked or not. So that was pretty quick. You can see here, like it copied three of the folders, which is good. and. Somehow it skipped three. Uh, I'll have to check and see what that is, but let us, oh, this, this actually includes files. And I remember, so if you come over to over here, so remember that we ran the command to only copy these two folders and we're going to exclude these three. So if we go into our test two folder here, as we can see, we copied the two subdirectories and its associated files. So that is how you go ahead and exclude certain directories from being copied. Uh, it, oh, actually, if you scroll up, it will tell you here. So it excluded test three, four, and five. And yeah, that is it. So hope you found this video helpful. I will be making some more RoboCopy tutorials in the near future. So be on the lookout for that one.